This is High Vibe TV, the uncensored, guided, and community-based video TV network with content recorded and live streamed from the world-famous High Vibe TV studios. High Vibe TV delivers daily, weekly, and special programs focused on astrology, spirituality, history, community, and more. This is not your run-of-the-mill astrology and tarot. This is the future of spirituality, illuminating new ways the collective can step into the dawning of this exciting new dimension. The highest vibe is truth, and the truth always prevails. Download our awesome app on the Apple and Android stores so you don't miss our notifications with special spiritual insights curated to the energy of the universe. Search for us on your TV with our exciting TV apps on Apple TV and Roku. Catch our vibe on your computer where you can join in on the live chat with our amazing community and blog. Watch spirituality like you've never seen before. Download our apps or go to highvibe.tv. Subscribe now. So the Senate passed the $858 billion defense policy, and they are getting rid of the COVID-19 mandate in the military. That time? Well, to me, it's like the Democrats went along with this to pass the bill, but at the same time, this is also a bill that was massively, massively, um, overwhelmingly bipartisan, right? 83 to 11. Wow. Right? And they're... Right. So increases pay for service members and ends the Pentagon's COVID-19 vaccine mandate, checking a major item off Congress year end to do list. But what's the craziest about the money in this bill? I had another article up that it itemized it a lot better. This is going in. Yeah. Hold on one second. It was uh, around to do this in the Senate. Mm. Oh man. Who is that guy? Oh, he's a senator. Okay. I do not know him. Okay, here we go. Here we are. So number one, that's the big deal. Eighty three to eleven vote, a blowout bipartisan vote. We haven't seen that one in a long time. It repeals the vaccine, but this is where it gets crazy. There's $847 billion, but it's an eight. Okay. That's all the most we've ever done. Yeah. In that 45 billion more than Biden wanted. The Pentagon receives 817 billion of that while 30 billion would go towards nuclear weapons development overseen by the energy department. That's another big article that just came out is that the energy department is saying that they figured out fusion energy. Okay. And that uses nuclear. So 30 billion going towards nuclear weapons, though. Nuclear weapons development that's going to be overseen by the energy department. So it's not just about energy, about fusion. A lot of people are saying it's BS. It's about us building nuclear weapons, more of them secretly, which goes against the whole entire world. This is actually what Hitler did, right? He got out of the League of Nations, right? And he got out of the Treaty of Versailles. Guess what? This is like America getting out of the nuclear treaties that we've all made in a secret way. Two, that the total comes to 858 when factoring in accounts that don't normally fall under the Armed Services Committee jurisdiction. Both parties also touted that 19 billion of the increase to Biden's budget goes towards mitigating inflation. In what way? I don't know. The measure also poured 32 billion into shipbuilding to buy 11 new hulls up from eight from the Navy. You don't think we're going to war? It also authorizes 69 F-35 fighters. Those are fucking like 40, 35 million a piece. Eight more than the Pentagon requested. The bill halts Biden's plan. He had a plan to stop developing a nuclear-tipped sea-launched cruise missile. We're going to do that. And scrap the U.S. inventory of B-83 nuclear gravity bombs. We are going to keep those nuclear gravity bombs now. It's this, and then... Um, so think about the war energy, right? It's insane to do 11 holes. Those holes are billions of dollars. It's insane. We're building our Navy just like we did right before World War II. Well, I was going to say it sounds like they all know something that we don't. They all do, and they all know not to have the military be vaxxed, right? Right? Then I was on my telegram and I follow this guy 
who's actually in Ukraine, Russia, right? Russia has been destroying Ukraine. Here's a video from today. But what's uh, even more crazier is he just posted this up um, just as we were doing this. That well, the whole entire, so explosion, electricity problems reported in Kiev, about 12 missile strikes um, were carried out in that someplace I don't know, explosions. Um, so basically, it seems Ukraine is getting heavily hammered across Ukraine today, the sound of explosion in Kiev media. Then Russia, a huge development that will tilt the power, um, the end of the p p petrol dollar. Russia led trade block will soon stop using dollar this just 1 24 a.m it's 1 or it's 2 37 a.m so an hour ago so yeah. now our economy and also all those sanctions will mean nothing correct that's and and, and it's it's really fucking crazy. I mean, there's like a million other articles that I went through this week about the Russia stuff and how, I mean, I mean, oh, actually, I, we have to show it because it's fucking gnarly, right? Like Putin, Putin made a huge warning, right? Putin went super intense, right? Uh, and he, he warned the U.S., right? He just made a major, major, yesterday, he just threatened here, boom. What the U.S. sending a Patriot missile defense system to Ukraine could mean for Putin's war. Putin fucking went crazy. Said, "If you do this, he made he made a he made a huge threat." I'm trying to find it right here. Uh, da, 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 da. Uh, uh, okay, early warning, and then the Patriot missile systems. Uh, uh, Why are you looking for? Oh, it? it's right. Well, it's right here. Um, da, 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 another step. Yeah, yeah. Putin says uh, Russia will fight sanctions. No, wait, 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 wait. Putin, Putin, worrying about uh, gears. Uh, he threatened the U.S. yesterday, and it's insane. So, but this is the, one of the Australian papers, and it's trash. But for the last twenty-four hours, maybe forty-eight, some of the major publications are not reporting on any of this but there are at one point i counted eight headlines all about megan and harry i know it's not news well annie's destroying his the monarchy no but it's really weird but you know what at the same time fuck it but here's the whole thing i, mean, I don't if, care because i'm american so if you don't like them don't follow it but that's not what should be reported on. If you want to watch the documentary, you go watch it. And if you don't, you don't. It's fine. But Putin threatening the US, huge news story. To me, that should be leading the headlines. Yeah. And even how it, you know. Oh, yeah. Nine minutes ago. Putin ramps up nuclear threat to West by moving missiles for third day running. Nine minutes ago. Has ramped up his nuclear threat to us by moving a powerful nuclear missile for at least the third time. So here he is moving the nukes. Oh, you know, remember I said I think it's going to be Finland that gets it? Or Denmark? Denmark's like the spot. Why do you think he would go for them? Because of the... The, the, the Nord Stream 1 and Nord yeah. Stream 2 being destroyed, and then the next day, Finland, Denmark, all of them come yeah. together. Oh, yeah, we have a new pipeline. The Mammoth missile system is identical to the Topo M missile system, except that it can store multiple ind uh, ind independently targetable warheads. These are kind of what like Kim Jong-un is trying to build right now. Mm. But, yeah, here you go. That'd be a nice day, right, in the world when that Ugh, launches off? Horrible. That's a practice missile with no, with no nuke yeah. in it. But um, So three days in a row, he's trying to like say, you better stop. We just look at our military. Like, 
I thought Trump was the military man. It's Biden. Biden's got more money than anybody. And both sides have done it now and given the money and they got rid of the COVID vaccine for the whole Pentagon. So that's all DOD. That's more than the military. That's all parts of the Department of Defense. So now that means they can all come together and fight. And to have 11 holes, I was in the Navy. Like one ship is a big deal. Two is a big deal. Eight that they were asking for was like, yeah, right. Oh, here's 11. 11. So. That draft is coming. That draft is coming because the fact that they took down the mandate. So is it possible the camps would be used not so much for people with psychosis or vaxxers, anti-vaxxers? Is it a prisoner, like a prisoner of war camp? I think they'll give you an option. You, you want to stay here or you want to go into the war? I'd pick war if I were you, but, you know, mm. at least you have a chance to get right. Or, well, or, or work through it in some way. Or Yeah, they're, 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 you, know you know can I mean? make choices you make versus choices. being stuck. But, I mean... If you think about the Pluto Uranus square that begins in March, that's all bringing up the Pluto Uranus conjunction of 64 and 65 and the drafts that followed right after that for Vietnam. So we're also in the Vietnam era of Chiron and Aries. So it's, it's, it, you know, the war stuff. Like that's the big, that to me, the biggest story is the NDAA always every year. Cause mm-hmm. they always do something new or different. Right. And this year they went way over the board and they gave 30 billion to nuclear weapon development to the energy department. So it's not just developing weapons, but it's also giving, is this fusion energy going to be about b- building fusion bombs? That's above nuclear. We've not been there yet. So fusion bombs. Think about that. They're trying to tout, oh, we're going to be able to make fusion energy. No, you know what they always do first? Before the nuclear power plants, before the nuclear, you know, energy was nuclear bombs first. So they always make a bomb with the new energy first. So when they came out and say, and that's that's the big thing, right? Fusion energy, right? Like fusion energy, or is it? With the Z? Yeah, few fusion. Oh uh, well, yeah, this was. Oh yeah, what fusion may mean for a carbon-free future. So here, right? So this is all. This is what the United States government and the Energy Department said that we does the U.S. really want clean energy. And fusion energy. So they're making, they're touting everybody like, yay, we found it. And this might be the big breakthrough. But the turn of direction, right, is it always goes to a bomb first. So scientists believe uh, achieve a breakthrough in nuclear fusion, right? So this is going to be bigger bombs, crazier bombs, way more. Oh, you know, the best way to put it, it would be a clean nuclear bomb. Think of that before you think of, oh, how you're going to help the world. Mm. Because w- w- when we, ha- we found atomic energy, what did we do? We built the two atom bombs. When we found hydrogen bomb energy, right? Oh, uh, uh, hydrogen? Hydrogen fuel cells? All these things? Oh, wait, that came... So, no, hydrogen bombs first. Oh, nuclear? Oh, that's cool. No, no, not nuclear bombs first. Fusion energy? Nuclear fusion? Oh, you have nu- nuclear fusion bombs. Then... Then get the electrical thing figured out. So, you know, that's that, welcome to Saturn Aquarius. You know, we got fusion, but it's going to be into a, bo- a clean bomb, meaning it's not clean, but it would, you know, it, 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 it will, you know what? It would be clean. That's crazy. So I just, I'm having clean? epiphanies like when, crazy right When now. you say it's clean, does that mean it'll blow shit up, but it won't have the radiation? What do you mean by clean? It would be cleaner radiation as far as it might look like. I don't know. This is so fucked up. But it would, you know, did you ever watch Terminator 2 Judgment Day when fucking the bomb goes off, mm-hmm. right? And then, you know, the kids at the playground and everything <gasps> in downtown LA. It would look like 
the Care Bears came through with rainbows and it all blew up everything. But there wouldn't be as much, like the destruction would be there, but it would not be so dark right? and dust, like radiation plumes. Right. But would it, would, it would still be horrible and it would be radiation. It just wouldn't look dirty. Oh, so it just looks better. It would look better and it would keep everything cleaner. Oof. What a great And it would world. hit faster. Awesome. Like you like right now if it happened, it'd be ah! <laughs> Well, you know, if it's going to happen. I always I dream about that fast. moment in life. Just, ah! Don't you hate when you jerk awake? Uh, that doesn't happen to me, but Oh, doesn't it? No, I just I, I just you know, Terminator Two Judgment Day when that came out, my, my grandfather showed me that on Laserdisc right when it came out. And I remember that that scene of when she has the visions and she sees it and she's like, you're all going to fucking die. <laughs> you know? And they're trying to eject her to shut her the fuck up when she's in the insane asylum. Fucking. And that scene of everybody, they're like, ha, he, the kids and everything. <laughs> Boom. I've just, that's always been in my head. Just of like, just we're all going to be one day. Ah! <laughs> like, it's so fucked up. But with nuclear fusion, it would be clean. But not clean. Mm. Right? Because like, that's what they say. is It's the toughest physics challenge ever conceived. Harnessing nuclear fusion, the power source of the stars. It would be like a star burst. Oh, amazing. and uh, there, there is but one. Do you remember when they were saying how amazing the, new, the atom bomb was and they put all those soldiers on the ship and watched it go off and they there are videos and interviews of them talking about how they could see through each other's bodies. It, it was like they were looking at an X-ray of the other person. I mean, and that was touted as being amazing until they all started dying of cancer. I was just speaking to Terminator and finally, finally, Newsweek, Sun could be heading towards Terminator event. The news just gets better and better. I mean, well, they finally showed that the solar cycles are, you know, what's happening in the 11 year periods that they're overlapping. So like the one that we were through 11 years prior, more like 13 years as it's finishing, the new one is happening and they're backing up on top of each other. That's never happened. But if you think of the pole shift and you think of the, of the magnetics and you think of what's happening, the kill shots building itself up kind of like how it's, the shots for people with COVID. It's like a, a layering. Great. So no matter which way we go, we're fucked. Well, I remember I said that the kill shot's the sun. That's what mm. we've always named it. But yeah. that would be what targets all the same symptoms that are in COVID. The bioweapon, I always have said, the bioweapon is to get people for when the electromagnetics go off the chain. 5G is a great way of testing that. But think of 5G nuclear fusion doubt mm. from the sun and everybody you know and then no electricity but if nuclear fusion has been found then we'd be able to use nuclear fusion and pump everything back back up if it was harnessed correctly and it was done correctly you mm. probably could go to the sites of nuclear sites and you could probably uh, well, you'd have to every transponder. They'd have to. I mean, honestly, yeah, we'd be screwed. We're screwed. But do you know what? Being without electricity, I understand we would have to. Adjust we would have to, to survive life. the nuclear power plants from not blowing up. Ah. Because there's just diesel gasoline gener or diesel generators that keep the water from cooling yeah, the old right, expended, years. and that's the number one issue in our life right now, and nobody's doing anything about it. They're not thinking of a permanent solution. They just have a solution where the diesel's old and generators that aren't checked much. And in case the power grid goes out or if that happens, you have about three days of generator power. And then when the generators go out, and then they're not even thinking about those generators. If it was such an intense terminator event, it would actually probably wouldn't start because it would fry out whatever electronics. So I was going to say, as scary as it would be, and I understand that we wouldn't be able to travel the way we do, like everything would become very 
We would go back to being in tribes, essentially, because we would have to. We would. Rely. You wouldn't be able to get out of your house for a good couple of years because all the nuclear power plants would blow up. No, so I'm saying without the nuclear thing, I'm just saying without power. Oh, right. We, like, it would be scary, but we would adjust because as humans, we come together, we figure things out, and we have different people with different abilities. So everybody comes together, works together, and this is why tribes form because you've got your people that take care of things. Everyone's got their part and you you move on. The nuclear element is where we get fucked. This is High Vibe TV, the uncensored, guided, and community-based video TV network with content recorded and live streamed from the world-famous High Vibe TV studios. High Vibe TV delivers daily, weekly, and special programs focused on astrology, spirituality, history, community, and more. This is not your run-of-the-mill astrology and tarot. This is the future of spirituality, illuminating new ways the collective can step into the dawning of this exciting new dimension. The highest vibe is truth, and the truth always prevails. Download our awesome app on the Apple and Android stores so you don't miss our notifications with special spiritual insights curated to the energy of the universe. Search for us on your TV with our exciting TV apps on Apple TV and Roku. Catch our vibe on your computer where you can join in on the live chat with our amazing community and blog. Watch spirituality like you've never seen before. Download our apps or go to highvibe.tv. Subscribe now 